Hey YouTube, how you guys doing today? Bring in another box from the big opening or big hobby box buy that I got. I accidentally bought two of these. I don't know how I bought two of these. So we're gonna hope for something big. I've never ever opened anything like this before. I mean, I'm guessing there's 37 packs because everything's out of 37. Uh, here's everything there, but we have one in 732 Cobalt Chuck. Jersey stick autograph, one card, hobby only. If we could get something like that today, yeah, I'll tell you that'd be insane. Um, other than that, Kramer's Choice. Yeah, I, I bought this because I like the Pacific patches they come out with. They're always super, super nice. Lots of colors in it. And there's the factory seal there. So yeah, let's just get right into this. I ha I'm guessing there's 37 packs, so we're guaranteed, you're not guaranteed anything, but two, two hits probably per box. 37 packs is absolutely ridiculous. This thing weighs like three or four pounds. It's making those Team Canada ones seem... Oh, there's two inners. Interesting. Interesting. So what is this? Oh, that's just that thing. So there's 18 packs in each one of these. So there's guess two little minis. 18 packs each, so we are guaranteed two hits then if it's one in 37. Actually, no, we're not. That's only 36. I cannot do math fast right now. So we're hoping to get two hits. Blue variation, authentic game worn, holographic silver variation, hobby only. So we're, we're hoping for a sweet patch of a legend. That's pretty much the only thing I can hope for right now. Well, that one looks thick. No. There's so many packs here. Oh. If you like pack opening and you're tired of this, like, Cup, Black Diamond, SP Game Use One Pack stuff. This is definitely the product for you. Holy hell! Okay, this is gonna be a while. I hope the cards aren't too stuck together. Oh, they're stuck together. Steve Passmore, never heard of him. Mark Bell, he did play for Ottawa, I believe, at one point. Special offer, 2003 Pacific NHL Hockey Rookie Update. Ooh, only $30. Uh, Wes Walls, oh boy. Jason Arnott, a lot of throwback names. Ar Arters Urbe. What a goalie. Absolute legend. Oh, here's a red one. Saku Koivu. Numbered? Nope, just a red. Radic Dvorak. Brian Gianta. Holy shit. Danis. Danius. Zubris. Okay, I gotta try to speed through these packs. It's going to take forever. Okay. Vamnoff. Oh, Korea. There we go. It's pretty sweet. Like a gold card in here. I'll just Dackle. Brendan Morrow. Oh, that's a good card to see. Mario Lemieux something. Kevin Weeks. And a Mario Lemieux Impact Zone. What were the odds on these impact zones? I'm just going to keep this off to the side here so I can see. Impact zone, 10 cards, 1 in 9. So definitely one of the better ones to get. Kim Janssen, Doug Waite, Dallas Drake, Scott Niedemeyer. Ooh, there's going to be a lot of cards here. I should never have bought two of these. 
I really wish I caught that. I would have bought another box of the, the Team Canada. For Erk. Titov. A German Titov. Never heard of that guy. Sacco Koi Regular. Eric Turgeon. Friesen. Josakic Impact Zone. Cool. Recky. Roman Chipmanic. God. Scott Mellonby, Brian Marchant. Alright. It's already almost six minutes into this video and I've only opened three of these packs. Okay, let's go. I'm not even going to say the names anymore. Just going to try to get <laughs> through these. Dieter Kotchen. Okay, I think the best way is going to be open up a whole bunch of packs, stack them up, and then go through them. I can see why breakers do this when they're doing case breaks. SPA or OPG. The ones that don't do this. Oh god. It must take like three hours to do one case. I might not even open the next boxes. I might try to sell it to someone. Oh boy, this is there's something else there. I'm hoping there's something good in here then. So did anyone out there ever open this when it first came out? About 16 years ago. This had to have been one of the first I know, I guess Black Diamond and whatnot. In the 90, 98, 97. Did anyone actually open this when it first came out? That would be kind of cool. They seem to have held their value pretty well. It was only on sale, five dollars off. I think I see one game used, maybe, towards the bottom. Maybe there's a chance that one, one Ender Death, I guess, definitely has one, and then one might have one. Okay, let's just fly through these, look for... Sergey Gonshar Red. Magic Gleam. It's a really good picture. I like that. K Tenge Rhodes Robitaille Salius Belfour. Ooh, what's this? Kovalchuk. Main attractions. That's a cool looking card. Don't tower back when he was with Ottawa. Can't believe we kept a redden over him. Oh man, Hashek. Get injured in the Olympic. Ooh. Lamp Lighters, Mario. So two Mario so far. Is it too much to ask for a third one? It's a game used or a patch. I'd be pretty okay with that. Stevie Y. Red. Oh, what's this? Peter Fedra. No idea who that guy is. Okay. And the Weiserman lamplighters. So at least for a product like this, they they do good players on the inserts. They don't just put any old. Ooh, ooh, that's a cool one. Shining moments. What are the odds of these? 
One in twenty. Okay, so this is the one hit, or not a hit, but I really do like the look of these. Hmm, pretty cool. And a red Archer Zerbe. Hey, a little bit less. So I think the hit. Maybe it's not. Maybe it's just too thin. I don't know. Kuba, Draper, a little blue. Rust, Slav, Klesla. Blue. What are those ones? One in 37. Okay. Uh, Sometimes first, James Key. Nicholas Lindstrom red. It's pretty cool. Okay. Red of Brendan Morrison. Guy is not picking up these red ones at all. Okay, what's this one? Brendan Shanahan, Impact Zone. If I open up 18 packs and there's not a single hit, oh man, I'd be frustrated. Gimasalani. It's got to be a hit rate. I don't know what that is. Oh man, these ones are really stuck together. Fedorov Red. Come on, you can do it. And Leech. David Leg Wands, Red Bonk, and E Rep. Okay, what other game use? Michael Pekka, there we go. Or something. Game used. Look how thick it is. The piece of fabric must be microscopically thin. Okay, so there's the one hit. So maybe each. I'm hoping the other one has a hit. I hope the other one has a patch. That's the whole reason why I bought these ones. Maybe you can't even get patches in these. Unless those are like the silver variation ones, which are... I don't know. I got no idea. I should have done some research before opening or buying these, but... Well... Turn in to be like a 50 minute video, is that? No, it's not good. Yeah, I think I'm gonna save the other Pacific box. I might not even open it for a week or two. I'll just look at it until I really, really feel like opening something. I think the other hit is in here. No. Okay. So I still have two boxes of Team Canada left. Those, those have been really good to me. Waiting for fatty. I don't see one that's even slightly fatter than any other one. So I guess something like this, you're just trying to collect, you're just a true collector trying to get 400 base cards. Trying to get them all in red. The true collective product of this one is. Uh, 
that's two cards, that's two cards together. Nothing super fat. Not even as fat as that last. Okay. I think it's in here. No. Oh, there better be another hit in this. I don't see anything that's a lot thicker than anything else. Okay, here we go. What is the red? Oh, no. Pebble Berry. If they had the autograph variations of these inserts, that would be really cool. There's a Theodore. An attraction. I got a blister on my thumb, and I got to push on it almost every time I do this. I don't like it at all. Kolzig. Photography they use for these cards is pretty good, though. I'll say that much. Come on. Red. Yanimana. Yane. Ni. Ninima. I know I'm saying that name wrong. What oh, is that? Keith Kachuk. Now we're getting cards of his son. Oh, we got two of these. They're one in twenty, so that's. Get two of these, and maybe only one game used. I don't like that. Christopher Colanos. He did not become anything. Uh, damage on it. Greg Johnson. Some of these maximum impact Roman Turk. Pretty cool. Or wait, was that? Hmm. Yeah, maximum impact are one in twenty-four, so there should be another one of those in here. And then a Zubris. Jim Dowd. And there it is. Maximum Impact Broder. I swear there better be... And a, th a third one? Okay, yeah. I guess three of them. Yeah, 12, 36. Yep. Maximum Impact Electrical Wall. Pretty cool. That's just a basic one. I couldn't even tell that was a game used in there. So no patch in this box. That's unfortunate. You know what? We got two of them. Can't be too upset at that. Jason Iron it. Good player. Chris Bala. I don't know. Maybe the other box. Maybe it's good luck that I bought two. Maybe the other box has a patch in it. Doug Waite. Philip Kubla. A 
another Maximum Impact, Sean Burke. Paul Korea, Impact Zone. The last one is a Brian Marchment. Do we not? Uh, I don't know. I probably probably when I was reading his names out. Okay, so 20 minutes later, our two hits. Jason Arnett, Michael Becca. Unfortunate, but oh, well, what can you do? That's a lot of cards. I can't believe that. All right, that's going to do it for this video, guys. Thanks for sticking around if you did. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.